is a quick overview about the types of collagen. This is not a detailed video. If you want a detailed video, you can click on the I button. But in this video, quickly we would review the types of collagen and their function and their distribution. So there are four major type of collagen with a really important in context of biological function. These are type 1, type 2, type 3 and type 4 collagen. Type 1 is enriched in the skeleton, in the bones. Type 2 is enriched in the cartilage. Type 3 is enriched in the arteries and type 4 is abundant in the basement membrane. So collagen is the most abundant protein in the human body and type 1 and type 4 are the most common types in human extensively modified by post translational modification this is one important point regarding collagen and it organizes and strengthens the extracellular matrix this is the key protein in found in the extracellular matrix now basically let's talk about the structural feature of collagen the most common motif that are present in collagen is glycine proline and x or glycine x hydroxyproline motif so collagen is basically has a triple helix structure which has two identical alpha 1 chain and another chain which is known as alpha 2 chain which differs a little bit in terms of the chemical composition if you wanted details about the structure you can click on the i button to go to the detailed video <coughs> So the five most common type of collagens that we are going to talk about is type 1 which is abundant in skin, tendon, vasculature, etc. Type 2 collagen is highly enriched in cartilage. Mainly these, these constitute the collagenous component of the cartilage. Type 3 is enriched in the arteries. So basically these are reticulate uh, type of collagen commonly found alongside type 1. So basically type 1 collagens are also found to some extent in the blood vessels as well. Then there are type 4 collagen which constitute the basal lamina. So any epithelial cell would sit on basically a basal lamina. So every basal lamina would have collagen. That's really important, type 4 collagen. And lastly, type 5 collagen which is present in several cell surface like hair, like placental cell, etc. So these are more specific type of collagen which is localized in specific region in the body. So one can use a mnemonic uh, known as SCAB to remember where they are enriched. Type 1 is enriched in skeleton, type 2 is enriched in cartilage and A for arteries and B for basement membrane. So this is a quick mnemonic to quickly understand that. Now collagen or defect in collagen is associated with several disorders. So one of the syndrome that we talk about is Ehlers-Danlos syndrome. So this is also known as uh, basically extremely stretchable or flexible body type where you can see the skin is so loose that anybody can literally pick it up. Finger is so flexible that literally it can fold backwards also. So this happens due to basically defect in collagen. Type 3 collagen is deficient in the vascular type of Ehlers uh, Dalnos syndrome. But anyway, overall due to the collagen defect, things become more flexible and less rigid. Then there is Alport syndrome. Alport syndrome affects the kidney and it, it actually affects the tiny blood vessels of our kidney leading to a dis dysfunction of the kidney. One has to remember that uh, type 4 collagen which literally forms the basement membrane you can remember the word under the floor is defective in Alport syndrome and it is basically targeted by autoantibodies in good posture syndrome though we are not going to talk about good posture syndrome but in that case type 4 collagen is targeted by autoantibodies it's autoimmune disorder so that kind of cover ups the most important informations and things that you need to know about different types of collagen so i hope this video was informative enough if you like this video give it a quick thumbs up don't forget to like share and subscribe don't forget to check out the detailed video about collagen because it is really important and please support our channel using super thanks. See you in next video.